Delhi is in Chhattisgarh and this is ore based. If, if I make, suppose this is the Chhattisgarh and this is the railway track and this is the national highway number NX, NX6 connecting Mumbai to Kolkata. So this is Delhi uh, here. So this area is the rich ore mine that is called Delhi Rajhara. This is the ore, iron ore, and it's only 30 km from Delhi. It is very close to Dhurg. Dhurg. This is Delhi. We have the furnaces. This furnace is we established with the collaboration of Russia or the erstwhile USSR. We are importing coal. Coal from Sador Plateau, it is called Korba. From Korba, it is almost 250 km. We import coal and this is the local ore. Ore is only 25 km. So this is ore based. <coughs> I hope you came to know this is iron ore based steel plant with the Russian collaboration we established in the line of the decentralization of industries we established the industry over here in the remote part of the country most of the industries were established in third and the fourth five year second and the fourth five year plan in 1956 and to 70s 19 uh, 56, uh, 60, up to 70, those were the uh, most of the heavy engineering industries were established in India uh, by, under the different PSUs. But where the water comes, we require water. Uh, so they doesn't have river uh, in, this re in this region. But there is a reservoir here, almost 50 km away, that is called Tendula Reservoir. Tendula Reservoir. And this Tendula Reservoir we have constructed in canal, called Tendula Canal. Tendula Canal. So, Coal is coming from Korba, it is there, and this is all Vega inhabited region. Vega tribe. This is Vega tribe inhabited region where labor is cheaply available in the remote region. Limestone, it import limestone from uh, Bala Ghat district. So this is the line for the same reason. Uh, Bala Ghat. So they, they transport the line from Bala Ghat. And local manganese and other raw metals they are locally available, but basically line they import from here. Line, they don't have the limestone. So from Bala Ghat they import the line. Korba they import the coal, Dali Rajhara they import the iron ore. And labor is there, water they shift from the tank, the Nduna tank, and they have constructed a canal. In this state, unfortunately, we have a big uh, coal deposit over here uh, in near Chandalpur called Bailadila. Bailadila ore is there, it is the coal, uh, ore deposits are there. But we don't have connectivity like this. So we come all the way from here through Vaishaka Patnam, we have the electric pipeline. So we don't have, because this is the Bastar region, tribal region, forested region, forested forest of sal and the tea. So this is basically sal and partly tea. Tea is also there. And this is all, uh, this, the southern plateau is called Bastar plateau. Bastar plateau. So, therefore, 
whatever the iron ore we extract from Belladilla, it goes to Vishakhapatnam first, then it is uh, 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 supplied to other parts, and the, this is basically to export. <coughs> Most of the iron ore from Belladilla goes to Japan. Japan is the importer of Indian iron uh, Indian iron ore. I hope the localization factors are clear in this area why Bilai was selected uh, at this particular city. location. So it is very close to Durg city. Durg is there, uh, 4 km from the Durg. So this is basically that's a twin city under the same steel, steel authority of India is running this city. So this was uh, also developed in the third, uh, second five year plan. So thank you very much.